Now we're going to look at the tools necessary for the printmaking process when making a relief cut or relief block. For wood, using a wire brush on the surface of the grain will make the grain appear. Another interesting thing that we can do with printmaking is we can use found objects and pound them into the surface of the linoleum or the wood itself too. There's a whole variety of things. Your imagination will lead you into new avenues. This is a set of cutting tools, various gouges, C gouge on my right and V gouges on my left. The shape and width of the tool creates a line that's relative to the size of the tool itself. This larger gouge is going to create a larger mark. So on down the line, a little less wood is removed, even less wood is removed. Same thing here with the V gouges. More wood, a little less as we go down. These are the tools primarily used to make the matrix. We also need tools to print. The brayer is what we use to apply the ink on the surface. We also need a palette knife or two, an ink spat, a one inch ink spat, or um, a palette knife for our ink to mix the ink. When we go to print, once we've put the ink on the surface, we need some type of burnishing device. Um, this is a leather baron that burnishes the paper. Uh, this is actually an old valve from an automobile that's been put into a wooden handle that can be used to burnish. And my favorite choice actually is a wooden spoon that can be used to burnish the paper onto the surface of the block.